time. Hi friends. It's time to hear part of the big God story. Let's sing our Bible song. Now it's time to hear God's word. Hear God's word. Hear God's word. Now it's time to hear God's word. So let's look in the Bible. Boys and girls, we have a friend who loves the big God story. Who would that be? Hamilton. Hamilton the Hedgehog. That's right, Hamilton the Hedgehog. Should we call him and ask him to join us? Yeah. Okay, on the count of three, let's call them together. Are you ready? One, two, three. Hamilton, where are you? Hmm, I don't think he heard us. Maybe he's outside taking a walk. Yeah. Let's call him one more time. Hamilton! Hamilton, what do you have? Oh, friends, are we going to use a magnifying glass today? Yeah. Yeah. I think we must be hearing more about what God made. Hamilton, are you ready to hear this part of the big God story? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Friends, are you ready? Yeah! Yeah! Me too! Before we get started, where can we find the big God story? There! The? Bible! The Bible! God gave us the Bible so we can learn more about him. <laughs> It's full of things that help us get to know God and his son, Jesus. Let's pray and ask God to teach us. Hold your hands. Close your eyes. Quiet voice. Dear Lord, help our friends calm their bodies and minds to be ready to learn more about you. Amen. Today, we are going to go exploring through seven different creation stations. We are going to pretend to be detectives and figure out what God created on each day by looking at the clues. Let's go to our first station. In the very beginning of the big God story, God created something. Hmm, I can't remember what it was. Let's look at the clue that's here for us. You guys look at it. What is it? A light, a light bulb. It is a light bulb. I remember God said, let there be light. And there was. God called the light day and the dark night. So what did God create on the first day? Light. Light, day and night. All right, let's look at creation station two. What do we have here? Clouds. See some clouds. What's in that bowl? Some wow. dots and water. Some water, right? And dots. Yeah, there's water and there's some paper with clouds on it. On the second day, God made a big space above the water and called the big space the sky. Do you see the water and the sky? Yeah. What did God create on the second day? The sky. The sky. The sky. All right, now we're going to look at creation station three. What do you see in the pot? Dirt. I really like to play in the dirt. Do you guys? Yeah. On day three, God put all the water in one place so that we would have dry ground. He called the ground land and the water ocean. Then God put trees, plants, and flowers on the land to grow. We have some flowers that need to be put in the land. Can you guys help me? Yeah. Nice job. What did God create on the third day? Flowers. Yeah, land, water, and plants. All right, let's go to creation station four. 
God wanted great big lights in the sky to make day and night. Let's look at this picture. What big light is in the sky in the day? Sun. And what big lights are in the sky at nighttime? Stars and moon. Exactly. So what did God create on the fourth day? Um, light. The sun. The moon. And the moon. Stars. You guys are good detectives and helpers. Let's look at station number five. What do you see in this bin? There's fish. What else is in there? Um, animals. What kind of animals? Mm -hmm. Ducks. Ducks, parrots, birds, right? I see fish and birds. God wanted the oceans to be filled with fish. He wanted the sky to be filled with birds. What do birds say? Cheep, 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 cheep. Yeah, they cheep, they tweet. Can you guys make a fishy face? <laughs> Those are some good fish lips. What did God create on day five? Birds and fish. Good job. All right, what's next? I see in this picture some more animals. God made wild animals, farm animals, and animals that crawled on the ground. Can you tell me some animals that you like? I like the frog. You like frogs? What kind of animals do you like, Sadie? A pig. A pig. God made all of those animals. Then God said he would make a man. Can we find the man? There's the man. He didn't want the man to be alone, so he brought him a woman to be his helper. Sadie found the woman. What did God create on day six? People. People and? Animals. Animals. have one more day, day seven. God was all finished making our world, so he stopped and rested. God wasn't tired. He was finished creating. You guys were such great detectives while we figured out all the things that God made. God made our world and gave us this great place to live. Let's thank Hamilton for coming to be part of the Big God Story. Thank you, Hamilton. Thanks, Hamilton. Bye. Bye, Hamilton. Bye. Yay! Children, may you remember that God made our world and he made you with love and joy. Bye. Bye.